Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be storing photo cards. I want to do this before my mid-year photo card flip through because um, I have a lot of cards and I don't want them to be left out. I haven't had time to actually fill it. Fill it. <laughs> I haven't had time to film it because I recently just sprained my ankle and there's dog hair already on Felix, so that's great. Uh, <laughs> recently sprained my ankle and uh, also had just got back from vacation, so it's been all kind of a little bit of crazy two weeks. So I wanted to film it um, now, or at least relatively soon once I'm healed. So anyway, enough with the blabbering. I do have a couple of things to put away, actually. Let me. I also have this so many big inclusion or so many big inclusion. Sorry. So I'm gonna put these off to the side. So this is the amount of cards that I have. You can't. See, I can't grab the bottom because they are smaller sleeves. But we're actually going to start with the bottom bottom cards because we're going to start with my soloist binder. Can you actually do that? I guess you can. I'm going to zoom in a little bit just to make it easier. So I have changed my A4 binder to my soloist A4 binder or A5 binder, whatever the heck this thing is called these days. Um, so it just houses Alexa and Sumni at the moment. Uh, I do want to collect a couple of other soloists. I have formulating plans brewing because I do love soloists. I love them and I just want to support them. So <laughs> I'd have three Sumni cards, it looks like. So, um, I started from the warning era and then I also bought You Can't Sit With Us at my job <laughs> before I went on vacation. And so I pulled this one. So we are going to just go in here. So, yes, she is in the sparkly sleeves. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, I think I just want this binder to be pretty. So, all right. So here is this one. I bought these off of Merc Mercari US sellers for like okay prices, I want to say. Someone actually offered to sell me a card with the warning album, and I was just like, Maybe later, <laughs> because I don't know if I'm going to collect the albums or not. I just bought You Can't Sit With Us because like, I'm obsessed with it. So here's this one. These cards are so very cute. I love Sumni. She's literally like the best. And then there's this one. I really wanted to pull the other version of this card like really bad because I think she's in the um, like the outfit, the, the 80, not 80 style, like the 90 style outfit. Like, <laughs> I don't know. So I'm just going to put it. I'll put this here. So I want my favorite one to go on the first spot. <laughs> so here is that. Um, and then she just had Heartburn come out like last month and I love Heartburn. <laughs> so I wish they would have released like a physical for it, but I get it, you know. But like her hair was iconic, the redness of her hair was iconic. So I'm excited, that's my Sunday collection. And then back here is just my random Soren stuff and my other random cards. Uh, oh, I had a bigger thing for some of these, so give me a sec. I think I have... Do I have one of the thingies? I don't think I do. I was going to say, I don't know if I have one pocket of these, like, available and ready at the moment. I don't think I do. So, I'll just hold off putting all the bigger inclusions in, I guess. I wasn't planning on to, but I had a lot of bigger inclusions, so I'd rather just do it. <laughs> but Okay, so that was all for my A5 binder. So where are my girl group's binder now? Let me grab the cards that I actually need. Okay, so these are the cards that I have to put away. So, oh, I'm gonna knock things over. <laughs> anyway, nothing for Dami. I keep referencing this every soaring photo cards video, but I don't have Hermit Star yet from Apocalypse. And it's been how many months? It's been like five months or six months. Well, no, it's been like four months. This, this has just been real messy and I just, I can't keep talking about it or else it's going to cause me so much agita and stress. <laughs> um, I am looking into possibly buying some more pods from somebody on Instagram. I mean, they're a little, a little pricey, but it's okay because it's Jami and I love this woman for like my life. Let me see if I can like zoom in a little bit. There we go. Okay, so we're going to go back to... Well, I'm going to explain my Itzy collection first. <laughs> um, I've decided to collect my top two in Itzy, which is Leah and Che. Che has always been up there for me in terms of biases. 
and I have started to start kind of buy her stuff. Um, I haven't bought Checkmate yet, so I don't know my polls for that. Um, I was going to buy Checkmate before vacation actually, and I went to Target and they didn't have it. <laughs> so I couldn't buy it. Uh, so I'm going to wait until I go back to Target again and buy it. So I have some stuff on the way for her. Um, I haven't even separated the last couple of comebacks because I just have not gotten the chance to be honest. So uh, I will do that eventually. I just, you know, didn't feel like doing it with my ankle. So <laughs> all right, this is Luna, correct? No, it is Aislinn. I always forget the order of my own binders. Uh, I I ordered a couple of these, and I think I might want to trade with somebody for the last one. I don't really remember. I really just need one more card. <laughs> okay, now we can go on to Luna. So, I'm going to explain my Luna collection now because I don't want it to be a surprise. <laughs> I stopped collecting my top three because I felt like it was just too much at once. And I feel like I do that with myself where I just take on too much at once. Even though I was trying to take it slow in the first place, um, which I did for the most part, but it was just hard finding all of Jin Soul's cards, to be, be completely honest. So, um, I'm just gonna collect Heejin now, and Heejin's almost done. Um, I do have this card, which I think I'm gonna put here because I have a trade for this one. Um, and I did require a trade for the last missing Heejin card for my, um, for my Hash Jin. Which is very equally fair a trade because they're both from the same album. So, um, I have that on the way to me. Uh, I just sent out the trade yesterday, the Hashtag yesterday. So hopefully I get that. Um, and then I have this one, which I have been trying to find for like ever. And I found somebody selling, um, this one and this one. So I was like, heck yeah. So what I plan to try and do is trade my Heejin and Jinsoul, or not Heejin, Hanjin and Jinsoul collection for flip that <laughs> because I have sort of set, set Jesus Christ, I had sort of set up for it. It's temporary like this. Um, I'm, I'm planning on buying the albums too, so maybe I trade, but it doesn't really matter. Um, and I decided to trade this Eve, uh, solo member jacket thingy photo card from uh, Hulu to Eugen, so that way I can at least have something on my bias. Um, all right, and then now we're gonna move on to the, the moment that is Kepler. I love them. Literally, they're like this close to becoming an alt, and I know they're gonna disband in, you know, not that long, so I have these to put away. I am finishing the first impact, which is beyond amazing. So here is this one. Oh my god, this page looks so good. I love that. Okay. And then, um, yeah. Okay. I have this Eugen. Um, and then I have this Eugen as well. Oh my god. I'm so happy. <laughs> and then I have this Yes, so Cool. Okay. <laughs> Now the first impact zone, I really did that really quickly, but like I wanted to finish it before um, the blast. So the only, oh, is this, I think this is a regular album card. I think, give me a sec. Yeah, uh, this is a regular album card. So, um, uh, don't, I want to put this here. I'm going to put this here. And then if it doesn't go here, I'll, I'll change it by the time I, uh, Binder flip through heavens. Um, I did try and set up a trade for, um, oh, I have a trade set up for another Yeso, which is the other version of this Yeso. So, um, yeah, so I'm gonna put that there. But I haven't worked on anything else because I haven't traded the last of my pulls. And I really want to trade the last of my pulls. I am trying, I have traded for Bahie's um, mini postcard from the jewel case. So, <laughs> Yay. Um, and then what I did was I rearranged my pop section just by era, or not by era, by uh, release. So yeah, I have this one on the way that's from the other group order that keeps getting fucked up. And then um, I have, actually I'm gonna put something here because I have another pop coming. Um, I bought two Eye of Cards and a pop, a Bahie pop from somebody. So um, 
these are all my on the way pods. So I'm not going to try and collect too much for her because I'm still dealing with a group order from last era. So, you know. Okay. And then the last card that I have is for Swan, um, which is this card, which I think, did I trade or buy it? I traded for it, I think. Yeah, it was this one. Okay. Okay. So I'm literally missing one more card and then I'm done with this era finally. And I did set up for um, the newest comeback. Oh my god, what's it called? I don't remember. But I, I'm frustrated with RBW because, you know, they gave us two regular versions or like the main versions and they gave us the digipacks, which they give us more digipack than you get a digipack. You know what I mean? Like you only get one digipack per member. But you have four cards per member for a digipack, which is quite stupid. And I don't like when companies do this because it makes it ten times more harder for collectors like that, like us, especially Purple Kiss collectors, because Purple Kiss isn't really a well-known traded collection community thing. So, so you know, again, that's my rant on RBW and their packaging people. All right, I'm gonna go on to the next binder, which I think is 17. Okay, this is most definitely 17. So, let me grab all of those cards. So majority of these are, well, all of these are based the sun. And I did make a change um, in here. Recently I discovered that I I really wanted to collect a Mingyu, but it just wasn't working feasibly because his cards, again, he's one of the most popular members. So, you know, I can't collect him and his cards are just so hard to find. So I decided to just trade away his cards. So. Um, I just went back to the old five pattern for an ode and called it a day. All right, so let's go to, I have not even thought of the idea of sector 17. I don't think I even set up for sector 17. No, no, I haven't. <laughs> um, so these are the cards that I got from my group order from Loving Hoshi. Here on YouTube and Instagram, Kit always runs like the best group orders, and I don't join her group orders a lot, which is what I want to change about going forward. I want to join group orders from her. So, anyway, I do not have any pulls from Control. I unfortunately didn't get any, but I did trade for some. So, um, we have this Vernon. I love him. <laughs> the good thing about storing these photo cards is like get my white sleeve white sleeves back because i am so low on my white sleeves here's this other one and so i organize this sort of by feel so yeah okay so now i have these two cards um i did get a dupe of this one but i'm gonna try and trade it so um flower cup vernon goes here and then this vernon goes to its equivalent here and I'm only missing one Ray version, which is nice. So, my in frame, I guess I am. And then we have the Path version, which I actually got all four of his cards for. I'm so happy. Um, that made my whole entire day seeing my pulls and actually completing a version. So, yeah, this card was like <laughs> so on my priority to get because look at him. Look at him. <laughs> He's adorable. Like, look at him. And this one, too. Ugh. Tell me you're whipped for Vernon without telling me you're whipped for Vernon. Like, he's a dork. And I love him. So there's that version. Beautiful. Stunning. Never been done before. Cool. And then I have these three uh for the pioneer version so i'm just gonna take these out to make it easy on my life um okay so yeah i'm missing a bunch of cards but i do have a bunch of cards up for trade so if you want to trade with me wink wink nudge nudge um okay <laughs> so um mm, i know what i'm gonna do so I originally was going to put these on a different page, but 
Okay, so let me rearrange this page a little bit. Um, so I do, so this is gonna be the carried version page and the pob page. So these are the weaver's pobs that I got through the group order. I got the two photo card sized ones and then there was the um, bigger shiny one, hollow one, I guess. So um, let's see, what am I gonna do? I should really put these in sparkly sleeves because the other ones are in sparkly sleeves. Okay, so this is Pioneer. This one is Ray. So what we're gonna do. Oh, these are my big ones. Oh. Jesus Christ. I always get confused with the little package and the big package. <laughs> because Sometimes with these, I like to use the little ones if they match the other ones, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, come on, Vernon. <laughs> I put them in the wrong side. Sometimes I can't tell. Okay, so here's this one. I love this one. I would love to put it in the middle, but I want to put it in like order, you know what I mean? And then this is the, this version. Why is that happening to me? It does I can't always tell which one's the sparkly side and which one's not the sparkly side. Okay, so. Okay. So there's that. And then what I wanted to do was kind of a seven pattern. So. Oh, sorry. So like the paint versions will go up here and then the other versions will go down here. I think that's going to be cool looking because then, well, no, I want to do something. I want to do this. <laughs> I like this better. I was going to try and do it in order of version, but I did not want to. I just like flower cup burning better or like little, whatever that bed is, you know, heart burning. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't think I have anything else for 17. This was the page I was originally going to put them on, but you know, it's, it is what it is. Okay, so now we're on to the second to last binder, which is twice my Jong Yong collection. So, um, I was going to try to put her in sparkly sleeves too because I want her to look pretty, but then I just didn't like the way they were turning out. So, um, I actually finally have a card for this page. <laughs> it is her blue border signal card. It took me forever to find this <laughs> until I found somebody selling it. It was actually the person who sold me a bunch of my twice cards. Um, like my early twice cards, they were selling their whole entire Jung Yong collection besides a couple of cards and, uh, I bought it from them. So that's going to go here. And then I bought this off of eBay and they just shipped it today. So I might be done with Jung Yong before I come back. So, which is exciting. Um, and then, oh, I don't know why I did this to myself. Okay. Uh, so I decided to collect some extra cards for Jung Yan because I wanted to have a full, complete Jung Yan collection. So this, um, this is this. So what we're going to do is put these on the back. So I just want to, yeah, so I'm going to put these on the back. And I didn't really care about the message card being scratched or not because I don't care. So we can take that off. Cool. And then her other, the, like the one with the hearts in the corner where she's far away, that's going to go on the back of this one. And then I have her Summer Nights uh, message card thing. So that's going to go here. Um, I'm going to take this out, like the little red piece out that shows the message. Because I will put that somewhere else. I will figure out how to place, put it in some way, somehow. Okay, so there's that. And that goes here. Cool beans. And then I do have a trade set up for this other, well, you can't tell. <laughs> I have a trade set up for the other one. Um, not the other, what is love one. Okay. Um, yes or yes, I have her hand card, so that's going to go on the back of this one. That's not going there. 
this is going there. Okay. I feel like I didn't want to do this in the beginning just because it was real frustrating. Um, but now that I am doing it, it's going to be great to have a complete Jungyeon collection. So, <laughs> I'm excited about that. Okay. <laughs> this is not going to work out the way I want it to. I didn't want to collect this one because like it was an odd color border, but I like it now. <laughs> oh no. Okay. And then there's Feel Special. I do have her gold label version on the way in trade. So that's going to be exciting. And then her, like the gold border card, the really thin one, I don't have on the way yet. Uh, and then I have her far away card <laughs> for this set. So we'll put it on the back of Flower Jongyeon, I suppose. Just don't want the cards to like overlap on each other and then cause damage. Okay, so there's that. Take that off. I think that looks really cute. I don't know. Okay, <laughs> you guys can't really see. It's okay. Look how cute that is. Okay. Um, and then I did switch around my Formula of Love collection just a bit because I found a really cute um, pop that matches this one. I'll probably toss a picture of it on screen or something. I'm going to probably, I don't know if I want to take this out of the sparkly or not, but I just, it's so cute. <laughs> and I did put the IDs on the back. I also set up for, uh, Twice You and Me or something. Whatever the heck that album's called. I don't remember. I set up for it. Um, and I might join a group order for some pops. Because I want cute Jungyeon pops. Uh, I have also set up for some bigger inclusions I'm missing. So her More and More poster. Her Taste of Love coaster, her And her Formula of Love um, bookmark and result file postcard. I did order a couple things off of Bayi. So... Hopefully they can get them for me. Hopefully they can. Wing, wing, nudge, nudge. Bye. Okay, so that's everything for Miss J. This binder is unnecessarily thick. <laughs> um, even though I did take album and non-album out of or al uh, non-album out of here. Okay, so I have started my OT8 journey, and um, I. <laughs> I think I put this Felix away last time. Oh my god. This is going to be a, such an unbalanced out. Uh, I hope the cards don't get warped. Anyway. So. Um, I do have Felix's mixtape. Far away card. Or concept card. Um, I probably should not have set up for these. Until I actually had cards for them. Like I am not. I don't know. Okay. I have Felix's far away for I am who. So he goes right there. These are slow moving things, by the way. You know, if I find a trade for something that I don't, I want to get a, get rid of, like, I'll do it. Um, but I don't go seeking them that much. Okay. I did secure a trade for Jongens for this one. So that's going to be exciting. Um... Don't have one for this page, but I do have Sungmin's for this page. I feel like I am who and I am you are going to be such a struggle, especially with Kenjin and Lino and Felix. It's going to be such a fucking struggle, but it's going to be okay. I believe in myself, and it's not a rush, right? Okay, so nothing for this page. Nothing for this page. Nothing for that page. Do have a Hyunjin Miro concept, so. There's that. <laughs> I literally have like the two sides. <laughs> it's so funny. Okay, so we can skip past all of this. Um, I don't think I, I may have se separated the Vaunter now that I think about it. And I separated it in live and go live. Cool. Or no, I didn't separate go live yet, did I? No, I didn't. <laughs> That's like the last thing. Okay, so we're gonna go to no easy. So a couple of cards here for no easy to put away. Just three. So I have these two. 
Sungmin, and Jungin. So literally all I need is Felix. <laughs> and this is probably going to be the reoccurring theme of all I need is Felix. Or Lino. So I'm proving that like Lino is hard to find. Then I have this Jongin. So again, just missing Felix. Oh my god. <laughs> um, and then again, I'm still missing this Maknero. So now we can go on to... I don't have anything Christmas Evil wise. But I do have some no, uh, ordinary stuff. This is exciting. Okay. I still need this Lino. You'll find it's a... Um, You'll find it's a reoccurring theme. <laughs> but, okay, let me just make sure this is the right, this is the right back, okay. So we have this Lena, which I was looking for for fucking ever. And I couldn't find it, and then I found it. And then I have this Hyunjin, which is probably one of the banes of everybody's existences. Okay, so then we have a free, uh, completed page, which is nice. Um, and then I have this Sungmin. I think this goes on this page. Yeah. And then I also have this Jongin from this page. So again, the reincarnate theme is I need Leno and I need Felix. <laughs> so there are the album cards. And then here are, here is Hanjin's ID. I just, oop. I decided to collect the IDs just to make it full circle, I suppose. And then and then we have a big full circle moment. I have the last, last unit that I needed for this page. Dun, da, 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 da. Q sound. <laughs> so now all the units are done. I don't have to worry about it no more. Awesome. I'm excited. Now I just gotta worry about all the album cards, which I think my soul, um, my soul goal will be try to find this and these, these two. Um, because then I can be done ordinary and I can kind of, well, and these two, but like, then I can be done ordinary and just kind of move on with going backwards. So, yeah. Alright, so that was everything for this storing photo cards video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys soon in another video. Bye!